Hey fellow world dwellers, it's Angry Turtle and you can see it right, the Turtle Gauntlet, the Ugwa Gauntlet is in here and I'm rolling for the best legendary I can get, so you know what's coming, the weapon review and the real Turtle build, everything Turtle like, the proper outfit, the proper gauntlet and the backpack. That's a shell that will protect me. So that's all in the future. But today we are rolling for legendary. Have over 200 modules. Let's hope my luck will be way better than the last time. And before we start, there is something cool from G Fuel. Check out this latest invention from our sponsor G Fuel. It's a slushy maker. Just keep it in your freezer. Whenever you want a slushy, take it out. Pour the favorite flavor of G Fuel in. Put the little cap on, squeeze, as you can see there's still liquid in it for like around a minute all around. And of course the best part is, look, it actually works. It's full of slushy now. It's absolutely brilliant device if you need to cool yourself down. Check it out. Don't forget discount code TURTLE. Okay, now, so fingers crossed, we are trying to get a good Ogwa gauntlet. If I will be super lucky and I pour it soon, I will roll the pepper shaker. If I will get unlucky, no. We do not consider this option. We are rolling a good Ogwa gauntlet for my build. I have a total of 229 modules. Let's go. Damage to humans. No. Executioners. Limb damage. No. Instigating power attack damage. Weightless. It's good. After they fix the... After they will fix... The power attack to actually register. This one is really good. Okay, so I'm keeping that. I'm reloading the other one. As Jagger now, it's, it's terrible. So a good start. We are for a good start. The second Ogwa gauntlet. Aristocrats, no. Anti-armor weapon speed weightless. Did you see my luck? Okay, so we are going for secondary target. I have already two I wanted. Instigating power attack, anti-armor weapon speed. I could go for vampire, but I don't have more Ogwa gauntlets. So I have two great rolls. I'm going for a pepper shaker to get a quad. Can I get a quad? I have insane luck so far. Can I get a quad? Okay, ghoul slayers, no. Medic, no. Sealants. No. Instigating weapon speed. That's a no. Zealots. No. Troubleshooters. Uh, vampire. Vampire is really good. But no. That's not what I'm looking for. I want quad today. Vampire crit damage. Nope. Instigating. Definitely no. Junkies weightless. No. Hunters. No. Zealots, weapon speed, no. Furious, that's a no. Exterminators, okay, my luck abandoned me, I think. Medics, anti-armor, chance to hit in vats. Blooded AP weightless, no. Mutant slayers, crit damage, exterminators. Uh... Bloodied Shaker bash damage, Junkies bash damage, Bloodied Limb damage, Weightless, Two Shot Weapon Speed Agility, but Two Shot is just one more projectile, so that's not great. Nocturnal, Suppressors, Troubleshooters, Ghoul Slayers, Berserkers. 
Vampire last round weightless. Vampire crit damage. No. Executioners. Less AP. Zealots. Where is the quad? Is it. Oh, maybe quad is not possible. Is the quad possible? Is the quad possible on Pepper Shaker? I think it should be. Suppressor's weapon speed. Bloody crit damage perception. Hunters. Berserkers. Suppressors. Ghoul Slayers. Aristocrats. Vampire. Damage while aiming. Reload speed. Bloody. I'm not sure that that's getting quad at all. Assassins. Junkies. Quad! So it is possible! Got it with the last modules. Not a perfect roll, but it is a quad. So it is possible. Got it. All rolled. Already. Perfect. Semi successful with this shaker, to be honest, after amazing luck early on. But I got it. So I just got another Ogwa Gantlet that I have. Three rolls. Okay, another Ogwa Gantlet. Three more rolls. One. Armor penetration. Reflex melee damage weightless. So that's worse than my armor piercing one. One more time. Power attack damage one. Endurance. Okay, I will not try again. So I have two great anti-armor Ogwa Gauntlets. So my Ogwa Gauntlets, after rolling, I have great luck with turtle stuff, it's look like. The turtle stuff, I have great luck. Okay, all the, all the Gauntlets. I have just the plain quad pepper shaker, but Gauntlets. Instigating power attack damage weightless. Armor piercing, power attack damage, one endurance. And the third one. Armor piercing, weapon speed, weightless. So, I need to say, great rolls. There is no vampire that could fit this build greatly too. But I'm so tanky already that vampire is not essential at all. Great rolls! So, as you can see, I was quite lucky, and now let's hope for all the best with the build and everything, and I will, of course, be comparing the proper Ogwa Gauntlet with other unarmed weapons. How does it compare? In the department of the look, there is, of course, no competition. It's the best-looking weapon ever. There is no better. But we'll compare performance, too. And what do you think? Is it the best weapon ever? What do you think about my luck? I need to say it was way better than last time. Maybe because it's the turtle gauntlet. It's my personal gauntlet. So I was getting such a crazy good luck. When I switched to a pepper shaker. It ate most of my modules just to get one prefix of my choice. I know I didn't get vampire of the Ogwa gauntlet, but maybe... Turtles are not meant to be a vampire. Maybe they're just meant to be tough and punch hard. That's the way. If that's the way, it's the way we are going. So, I'm waiting for your input now. And now, as always, thank you a lot for watching and see you all in the next one.